I've known you for the past four years, and in that time you have constantly talked about two different people. One is your mentor, Jim Rohn. Mm -hmm. The other is your hero, your father. So I know that your dad actually switched from being an employee to an entrepreneur. So how did that, watching your dad go through that, what did you learn from that experience? Yeah, security was a big deal to my dad. Um, his father, who he had great reverence for, worked for the same company for 40 years. His mom uh, was a meat cutter, same job for decades. And even when he was a university football coach, he had a boss, you know, the head coach in one organization or the booster club in another. And um, so venturing out on his own was not something he was ever conditioned to do and had no reference point for it. So it wasn't until his, uh, his mentor, which is former football coach, um, launched a real estate career and really encouraged and prodded my dad to said, you know, you could do this. And my dad didn't believe it for a long time. It really took the very gregarious and charismatic uh, pushing and prodding, cattle prodding, um, to really encourage my dad to do it. He started out part-time while he had a job at a pneumatic tool company. And then when he started to make a little extra money, and that money became more than he was making full-time as an employee, he launched fully into his own business uh, with his mentor. And it was really his mentor that made it possible, um, not only to make him believe that he could do it, uh, but also be a guiding system for him. So that's one of the great motivations for why I wrote this book, is if you don't have that mentor to tell you you can do it, I want to be that mentor. I want to tell you you can do it. If um, you don't have the guidance of what to do and how to go about it, that's what this book can help you right. with, is to be that guiding tool to help you be a success as an entrepreneur. Well, how did the observations of your dad's journey impact you? Well, now I had a different reference point. My dad was an entrepreneur. Now I had a whole sort of different uh, perspective about what was possible for me. Mm -hmm. and, and as kids, what's the one thing we want to do? We want to be like our parents. Right. And we want to make our, our parents proud. Well, my dad was an entrepreneur. He was figuring it out on his own. And so that became a, a very real option. I was living and seeing and witnessing that option. Mm -hmm. So um, I owe great debt of gratitude to my dad for having sort of paved the way. The second thing that I learned is hustle. I mean, my dad was, um, I mean, he had to hustle because mm -hmm. there are many times I remember where it wasn't until he could cash a commission check before we could go to get shoes right. for school. It, it showed me, number one, that I could do it, and number two, if I wanted to do it, I needed to hustle and, um, and really dive in full headlong. And, and that's, um, those were invaluable lessons, and I hope that I pass those lessons on to everybody else. You can do it, and uh, if you're going to do it, you got to hustle.